Don't bother. Don't bother at the Rafi. You know what? They're just sleeping. BGC. So we got the two bedroom executive and look at this place. So we have here the dining area and that's the living area, living room area. And this is the kitchen because this is like a serviced apartment hotel. So nice, complete with all the washer and dryer and of course the ref. They also have a water dispenser here and uh, full of the uh, amenities for the kitchen and the coffee capsule coffee coffee facilities yes action plate yes Wash. Mi microwave microwave bedroom. two bedrooms and we're supposed to get one is with a king size bed and then the other is two single beds but we requested since we're couple uh we're couples actually we requested for the other room it, if it can be um, joined together the two single beds, but they gave us an upgrade. Wow. They gave us a, the other room for the two single beds with a queen size bed. This is room number one. So, this is the queen sized bed upgraded, and then they have the TV here and also the cabinet. Full dresser. Nice with bathrobes. Bathro bathrobes. Sleepers, slippers, bathrobes. But the, How's the, the view? bathroom here is segregated. It's outside. Okay, the view is off. I think this is another street. Yeah. So wow, another corner. Nice. Um, side there. So as I mentioned, the bathroom is located outside the room, which is pretty big. So, bidet. <laughs> and there's the shower area. With compli soaps. Then the usual compli um, areas and soaps. Alright. Then the master's bedroom. The master's bedroom. So this is a king size bed. And complete with TV. And also the view in on this side is what views this court. The I think that's Fourth Avenue. If I'm not mistaken. Wow. So that's the view here. So full amenities, full yeah, plugs like at every corner. Yeah. This is a king size, no? Yes. Then they have a dresser they here. A dresser and look at the bathroom. Wow, bathtub. Bathtub. Yeah, full double sink. Bidet, of course. Bidet. All right. So wonderful. Thank it's, you, Ask at BGC. And most importantly, it's pet friendly. Yay! They've recently woof, become woof, pet friendly, they said. And so a lot of people are endorsing them. Even our bellhop, Charles, who's a great guy, oh. took our photos. He also has a Shih Tzu. Oh. So join us for a wonderful web venture here at Ascot BGC. Andiamo.
he doesn't like his Santa hat anymore. In protest. Okay, we're ending the vlog here. We normally end vlogs, especially travel vlogs in the hotel or in the resort we we're in. But for some reason, we're ending it at home because we got COVID. <laughs> we got COVID, not because of Ascot BGC, but we got COVID even, I mean, because it's the season in December 2023. Mm. A lot of COVID cases have come out and we are one victim of that. I left the hotel driving home with COVID when I realized, and, and I didn't realize it when I was there, I was just vomiting, mm -hmm. I had a headache mm -hmm. um, again, and at least it was in a nice place, but yeah, mm -hmm. we had COVID. So we're ending it here and just giving it a final review here. So what do we love about Ascot? One is um, it's part of the hotel membership group, which I also am a part of, Discover ASR, because you're able to um, reserve way ahead of time, which I was able to uh, reserve mid 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 year of uh, 2023 and you don't need to pay in advance so that's one good thing and also we love that um we our, our requests were very much accommodated even before we checked in and uh, we'd like to mention specifically one person the reservations officer jack thank you for helping us out with the parking slots Thank you for um, also accommodating us with the rooms, most especially because we got two executive bedrooms and um, we requested for, for the beds to be together, especially for the single beds, as we mentioned at the start. So we love Ascot. The, the decor is so nice, so homey, mm -hmm. so luxurious. Actually, uh, like in Ascot Mahati, similar treatment in BGC. We love yeah. it, it's a newer building. We love its proximity to BGC, especially 5th Street. Mm. Um, you saw in the vlog that the, we saw the preparations for New Year's and you just felt the energy be being near there. Just going down the hotel, you could walk easily to 5th Street, to High Street, 5th Avenue, then High Street. We love its pet friendliness. Yeah. Um, we we found out that 
that it has recently been open to pets. And so we love our pets that our pet beautiful boy Corgi was able to join us there. Yeah. Um, and we saw other pets there. So it's a good plus. And it's one of the top hotels, luxurious hotels especially, that are accommodating pets. Right. And also we really love the staff. They're very friendly and some of Top them much. are also um, pet lovers. Yeah, we saw a lot of people had Shih Tzus like us. So yeah. so nice to be with people who knew what we had. And and we we love and respect all the pet mm. policies like the pet fee is one five per night as we posted per mm. pet. Two pets allowed uh, max. And, and BGC is very pet friendly. So just yes. going out, you could walk your pet easily and enjoy there. Yes. And what else? Of course, the all the facilities, the amenities. Um, it's like you know, you're you're in a home away from home. So it's good to really celebrate the Christmas holidays there. You can cook. You can really um, spend time with families uh, because the, it's like you know, together in one big room. Dine. They have a dining room, a living room. So that was wonderful about Ascot. Anyway, so to conclude our stay, we just want to say that Ascot BGC is for approved. <laughs> so thank you for joining us to follow Corgi. He's very active. Well, he his account is very active on TikTok and Instagram. Check his reels. Follow us for more. Subscribe to this channel as we bring more pet-friendly places, pet-friendly adventures to you. And till then, till the next adventure, wabak! <laughs> <laughs> I got it on video. <laughs>